everyone, so today I'm going to be showing you a quick fashion video on a few different ways to wear this mint green shirt that I showed in a haul video. It's from Forever 21, it's just a sheer mint green shirt with a collar, and there are a bunch of different ways to wear this, and mint is a huge color for the springtime, I'm sure you guys have already seen it, but I think it also looks nice on a bunch of different skin tones. Uh, it looks good with different hair colors, eye colors, so I feel like everyone can kind of pull off mint. And there are a bunch of different ways to wear it, whether you want to tone it down or kind of really have it be the center attention of your outfit. So I'm going to go ahead and show you a few of my favorite ways to wear this shirt, and I hope you guys enjoy. Okay, so this is the casual and how I would wear this if I was going to the beach or the pool or I just wanted to look casual and wear it as kind of a swimsuit cover-up. So since it is a sheer shirt, of course I have a swimsuit on. Um, this is a coral and polka dotted swimsuit that I got from Victoria's Secret last year. I really like the contrast of the white and the coral and the mint green. I feel like they are complementing colors and they look nice together. And so yeah, the swimsuit is from Victoria's Secret. Now this little fedora hat that I have on I think is really cute and just kind of adds to like the laid back kind of just very simple vibe that I'm going for with this outfit and I actually got this from Forever 21. It's just a little straw hat with a little black kind of ribbon detail right here that kind of makes it a little bit girly and I just have my hair kind of messy wavy how I would have it if I was going to the beach. And then as far as accessories, I have on this cuff bracelet, which is from Forever 21, and it has a bunch of different multicolored beads. It's really easy to wear because it's not big and it's not bulky, and it's also kind of just like stretchy, so if I want to take it off, if I'm like at the pool or the beach, I can, but it adds a little bit of color to my outfit, and it's not like a lot of um, jewelry that's going to get in the way if I'm being active and walking around and swimming and such. And then for the bottom of my outfit, I have on some white shorts from Forever 21, and they're just kind of like a really thin, stretchy, almost like a denim material, but super thin and comfortable, really easy to just slip on over a swimsuit, and they go nicely, I think, with the mint green color because they're white, so they just kind of add a little bit of freshness to the outfit, and they're just overall really comfortable, and I believe they were only like $13. And then for my shoes, I have on some braided leather flip-flops that I purchased from American Eagle. Alright, so this is the next outfit. It's a little bit more formal, but still pretty simple and um, just not a lot of pieces go into it, but I think it looks really cute all together. So first of all, this little lacy bandeau top that I'm wearing is actually from Nordstrom. It's just like a straight across bandeau with like a lace trim. And I have this underneath the sheer shirt because um, you should wear a tank top or something, uh, probably not just have your bra showing. And then I have the front tucked into the skirt. And then I left the back out, so you can see it's just kind of long and drapey in the back. And then this little bandage skirt that I have on is a really soft cotton skirt from Forever 21, and it has black and white, or it's black with little white stripes. And I think it works really nicely because the mint green top is kind of the focal point. I didn't want to do a bright skirt for this look, but you can, of course, do the color blocking look. But I think this makes it um, maybe a little bit more like business casual if you are like you have a job or something and you can't wear super bright colors, but you want to get away with wearing a bright top. I feel like the neutral bottom and kind of using the black, it kind of tones it down a little bit and makes it a little less loud with the color. As far as accessories, I have one of my favorite bracelets, which is like kind of my studded bracelet from Forever 21. And then my shoes are just these small wedges with a front strap and an ankle strap, and these are just from Nine West. And they're very comfortable, and I think they add a cute little touch to the look. So this is the next outfit, and this one is kind of casual. So first, I have the shirt just knotted up like this, and then I have the same bandeau on. I added this really cute floral necklace that is from Forever 21 as well. It has just little gold kind of beads in the middle, and it's just this big statement necklace that I love. And again, I really love the contrast of the black and the mint. I think it just looks really cute together. And then for my jeans on, I have some of my favorite jeans, which are my Seven for All Mankind, just ripped up little um, kind of boyfriend style capri jeans. And they have just rips and such. 
and I feel like it gives it kind of a more casual look to the overall outfit and even though it's kind of dressy with the lace detailing, um, the kind of blousey top and then the more kind of fancy necklace. And then for my shoes, I have my favorite two-tone, kind of almost Chanel-inspired ballet flats that I purchased from Nine West. Okay, now this is the most formal of all the looks and probably the most daring one. People probably um, might not like this one, but I personally really love it and I think it's really interesting. So mainly what I'm doing here is I have a lot of texture going on. I have this textured lace skirt that I got from lulus.com. And then I have this pale pink lacy bodysuit, which I got from ASOS.com, and I have it paired over just a nude bra, if you're wondering what type of bra you'd wear under this. Of course, I have on the blue shirt, but I have it kind of loose and just flowy to kind of cover me and give me a little bit more coverage up here. And then as far as accessories, I have my white quilted ASOS bag with the gold chain, a few gold bangles, and then I have my hair just tied upwards to kind of make sure that it's not taking away from the outfit because I know it's a lot of textures and colors going on. But I really love all the pastels and pretty prints and I feel like this is a very springish outfit. Now as far as shoes, I think a nude heel would work best, but I didn't have one so I'm just kind of making what I have work and I really think a sparkly nude heel would be so pretty but these are a little bit more silvery than kind of a gold pink ivory that I would have gone for but I think they work overall and they give it kind of a young fresh feel because it is kind of a little bit old feeling with all the pastels and lace. I also wanted to mention that my nail polish is Essie's Turks and Caicos and I think it matches my shirt pretty well so I really like this color and if you're looking for a good mint green nail polish I definitely would recommend this one. Okay guys, thank you so much for watching. Please leave me a comment of what your favorite outfit was that I showed today. And let me know if you would like more of these videos where I take one piece and show you a bunch of different outfits and different ways to pair it. Because I think it's fun and also helpful, um, especially when it's kind of like trendier pieces. So anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed and I'll see you guys later. Bye everyone!